Hello, today we are going to mention how to apply face recognition in Python. We will use Deep Face Framework to do this task. It's fully open sourced and its code is already pushed to the GitHub. Also, it's available on PyPy. All you need is to run the command pip install deep face. It handles the installation of the framework itself and also its prerequisites. You can run this command on your notebook after this symbol. But I have already installed the framework, that's why I skip this step and import the framework directly from deep face import deep face here d and f letters should be in uppercase we will test face recognition task on these images two of them are angina julie whereas one is jennifer aniston let's the image one pet x image one dot jpeg whereas image two pet is image two dot jpeg we will change the content of image one and image two pet variables later here i would like to import open cv to read the image and also import matplotlib dot pyplot to plot the image here open cv dot imread and pass the image one pet and that's going to be my first image and similarly the second image will be opencv.imrit and image 2 pet here plt.imshow and pass the image one will show the image the color of the image is blue because opencv reads the image not in red green blue respectively it reads the inverse order we can fix this just like that as seen that's the original color of the image and also show the second image but it shows just the second image that that's why i'm going to call plt.show after showing an image as seen two images are shown deep face here verifies uh, two of these images are same or not that's why i'm going to here call deep face dot verify and pass the uh, image one pet and image two pet and that's going to be the result verification is over let's see the content of the result here it returns a tuple consisting of three items here the first item is the verification result it returns true this means that these two images are same person the second item is the distance between two images and the third item is the maximum threshold to verify in this case the distance between two faces is less than the maximum threshold value to verify that's why it's verified positively here i'm going to check the first item let's create a function and move the code after reading the image into the that function because i'm going to call that function for different images name of the function will be verify and it expects image one pet and image two pet and we firstly read the images then show images then call deep face dot verify function and here let's print the result this is the result and get its first item i no longer need these lines
and I'm going to call verify function here and pass image one dot jpeg and image two dot jpeg. Sorry, I forgot to call this block. In the verify function, let's check the verification result. If it's true, then print they are same. Otherwise, print they are not same. And I'm going to call this block again. They are same because the both images are on Jenna Julie. Let's call verify function for other case image 1 and image 3. Remember that image 3 was for instance and the result is they are not same. As seen the distance between the two faces is much larger than the first case and that's why it's classified as not same. Now check image 2.jpg and image 3.jpg. That's the compression of Angela Julie and Jennifer Aniston too. And they are not same in this case. We just call deepface.verify function and pass the paths of two images. Deepface supports several face recognition models. In default, it uses VGG face model. I mean that. That's just identical to. model name is equal to vgg dash face this is identical to the line above we can pass the model name as the input to the verify function and in default it should be vgg face and pass model name here let's check image 1 and image 2 for for example Facenet model. These two images are verified again in the Facenet model, but this time the second item, uh, which means the distance between two faces, are different than the previous case. Or we can verify image one and image two based on another face recognition model, which is Open Face. It's verified again, but this time the distance between two faces are different. It's much less than the previous cases. In this case, also the third item, which is the maximum threshold value to verify, is different than the previous cases. This item shows difference based on the selected face recognition model and the selected similarity metric. So we have mentioned how to apply face recognition in Python. We actually need to just import the deep face framework in a line and in the second line we need to pass the paths of two images to the verify function under the deep face. And we should check the first item of the result element here. If you like the deep face project, you can support this project by storing the GitHub repository. In advance, thank you for your support. Thank you all for watching and see you next time.